Hello, everyone. So good to see you all. So nice you all to turn out for this uh, kind of earlier uh, weekday. Uh, what the fuck? Yeah, because yeah, weekday because I don't stream uh, on weekdays. In any case, thanks for coming. Uh, I'm not going to play a video game here. Yeah, not going to. Not going to do it. No video games. So if you came here to see a video game, eat shit. Okay. <laughs> But it is good to, to see you all. I hope it's as good to see me. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit. Mm. Oh, he looking tasty. Mm. Actually, I think I look like shit. Uh, this is, uh, this is just what I wear now. I think I'm just gonna wear this, uh, all the time. It's what I wore to the, well, one of the, the outfits I wore to the, the to the one of the cosplays I wore to the convention. If you didn't see it, uh, yeah, my cosplay was adult. I figured I'd try out seeing what it felt like to be a re a real adult man. I got, of course, I got it at New York Man Suits, which is the only solution for when you're not a man but need people to think that you are. Mark Zuckerberg also, yeah, had shopped there before going down to to, to Washington. Uh, Brunsbane. Free! Welcome back to the family. First time in a while I've caught you live. And we're not playing a video game, yeah. So, okay. Yeah, oh, this isn't, this isn't, uh, this isn't washed. Um, I'm just, like, kind of, like, like, you know, I have, I'm having, like, that post-con depression thing. And the way that I'm getting over it is I'm kind of just, I'm kind of just sitting here and soaking in the juices. You know, I'm, I'm kind of like just basting in it because th these clothes, like they actually have all the sweat and like combined butt butter of everybody that I met at the convention. And I feel like if I wash it, like it'll just like, I won't, ha I won't even have that anymore. It's like when you meet a celebrity, you shake their hand and then you refuse to shake their hand. Oh, it's loaded with con flu. Oh, Bruins Mania, it's loaded with con flu. Wait a minute, who's this? Jabroni Mike. Oh, are you are you the the Jabroni Mike? Yes, yo, I had a very uh, a very hard time <laughs> uh, finding all the, the social media shit. Uh, did you see? I had to use an underscore. You did this. It's your fault. I have a stupid fucking underscore. I'm just kidding. No, no, <laughs> no hard feelings. Nice to finally meet you in the flesh. Even though that that's definitely not in the flesh. But thank you to come check out, uh, for coming to check out the channel. <laughs> You know how much emotional trauma you've caused me, Jabroni Mike? Look, what? <clears throat> Wazaka. Free Elka back to the family. See, the problem here is... Part of the reason I don't want to do a full, like, video game stream tonight is... I'm, I'm still recovering from the from the weekend, man. I, I just basically... I just talked for, like, three days straight. I met all kinds of awesome people. Uh, new people, old people, people I knew but never met in person. Just, it was so fucking cool uh, to meet to meet everybody. Putting faces to names. That's one of the things I love doing. It's one of my favorite parts of doing those conventions. Like, um, people were saying, it's like, oh, I didn't want to come up to you and, like, break your balls. And, you know, because you look... It's like, no, no, no. Please, break them. That's 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 why I came here. It's what I wanted to do here. So, please, just run up and fucking just hit him with a sledgehammer. Go, uh... Oh, what the fuck? Go Gallagher on them shits. Just... <laughs> Go full fucking Gallagher on my balls if, if, if you see me at a con, please. Uh, actually, did I just, like, invite people to, like, mutilate my testicles with a sledgehammer and... You know what? I'm gonna have to find a better way to, to, to phrase that. But in, in the meantime, uh, let's just say this. Don't be afraid to, to come and, and speak to me uh, civilly at a, at a convention. Wait a second. Serbian teardrop breeze up. Feel back to the family, true blue. Feel back to the family. Lugia at level 100 says, did I meet Vine Sauce? You know, I wanted to. The line was just, was, was too long, you know, but, uh, but I did meet some other, other cool people. We'll get into that in a minute. Uh, I see, I see some people, oh, Bish and Gengar. Sometimes I put my hand up like that, because I think it, like, helps the acoustics of the jack. Oh, that's actually another thing. Fuck, there's so much to talk about. Shit. Um, wait a second. I see people, yes, asking about the hat. One of the many things that was given to me, uh, one of the many gifts I received at uh, at the con, uh, I have a fucking stack 
of gifts here. Most of it I haven't even like really had a chance to look at myself. I want to just I'm just going to show you guys all the swag that that people like uh made for me, bought for me. Uh, a lot of money was spent on me at this convention, which I like, kind of, you know, you know how I feel about that. Like I'm a little upset by it, but a lot of it is is, is so fucking cool that like I can't be, you know, I I can't be that upset. Um but uh, we're going to we're going to take a look at, at at all this. Um I will get to I will get to every single one of your one of your fucking questions. I I swear. But I mean, let's start uh let's start working through this pile of shit. Um I should I shouldn't call it shit. That's rude because this <laughs> some of this was was uh was made with love. These items, let's call it items. Uh Wait a second. I'm going to start with Wolf, uh, Wolfster. I, I had the pleasure of meeting Wolf at, at TMG, and I received many gifts. See, some of them were, were edible. Wolf, I'm very sorry. Uh, Wolf, is, Wolf is from Vermont, and if you didn't know, uh, Vermont is like a dairy capital uh, in, in America here, if you don't know that. So Wolf thought it would be a good idea to bring me some, some cheese some vermont cheese and uh there were there were two bricks of it i remember in in, in the hotel room one of the hotel rooms uh, i did get to eat some of the cheese and it was delightful however uh wolf wanted me to have a personal brick a personal cheese brick now it was a hot weekend and there was a lot of stuff that got left you know in the in the car in the hot sun uh and one of them was the cheese brick it didn't do so hot so this brick of, of cheese was <laughs> it was left in the car for i think uh two days it got completely forgotten about Wolf, I, I'm, I'm sorry i really wanted to eat this i'm a, i'm as upset about it as you are i really wanted to eat this it was fucking delicious but i mean it's been melted and like reformed so many times you can see there's there's two layers of of fuck to this cluster fuck because you had the cheese itself that got completely melted and reformed. And then the waxy outside. The waxy outside got completely, completely fucked. So now I think like maybe the like the wax got mixed up with the cheese particles. This has this has not been uh, uh, refrigerated. The, the stench of this is, is really unfortunate. Um, I, I'm having a very hard time with it right now. But I did think it was important for you guys to see this. Uh, so, I, so I dealt with it. Um... You know what though? It's kind of canceling out like the like the the butt butter smell that's on the clothes I'm I'm, I'm wearing. It's creating a like a pungent kind of like they're canceling each other out. It's it's like <laughs> there's some kind of chemistry at play here that I I can't begin to understand. Um, I'm sorry about the cheese, uh, Wolf. But Wolf also gave me some like maple syrup candies which I inhaled, and also maple. I. Maple syrup from Vermont. It's another one of Vermont's uh, claims to fame. If you didn't know, uh, I'm gonna just uh, I'm gonna just chug these. I mean, I don't really eat pancakes, so I don't know if I'm gonna have another opportunity to to eat this. Like, cause we don't really eat pancakes here. Like, I'm not a pancake guy. I'm not a waffle guy. So I figure like. And I can just sip it over time. Oh, it smells intoxicating. Chug it? Should I chug it? It's kind of warm, though. It's warm and sticky and gooey and we're gonna just leave that. I'm not even gonna I'm not even gonna finish what I was gonna say. I'm not I'm not I'm not doing that. It's come, it's come, it's come, it's come, alright? It's come. Let's just do it. Fuck it then. I'll take I'll take a sip. I'll take a sip. Yes. Uh Anna. I'll take a sip. It's delightful. It's Vermont organic maple syrup. And this is the cool thing about this. It says it's uh, whiskey barrel aged. And I, I taste that in there. 
Like there is that like a little kind of uh, an oaky aftertaste going on. Like you 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 take a sip of that, and there's like yeah, there's a faint a faint kind of a whiskey thing going on there. It's really cool. Um, and they. <laughs> I wasn't ready to see Bukake today. Whoa, wake the fuck up! Wake up and smell the Bukake. All right, moving on. There's a lot more, a uh, lot more shit. I mean, stuff, stuff, stuff. Where that came from? Oh, I should have just used some of the um, the, cum the cum socks from the um, from the luggage. <clears throat> Who else did I meet? I met Luigi guy. Very cool. Very cool. Very, very cool dude. And I received this gift. Oh, nome de Christi do nep nep. Oh, in the nome de Patrius do do in the nep nep of our Lord and Savior. I don't know what the fuck that song is, but it's a little nep nep made out of perlers. <laughs> Thank you, Luigi guy. <laughs> I love you. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, oh, Luigi guy, give me your yogurt. Oh, fuck. No, let's not make it weird. Thank you for the gift, Lukes. Very cool, very fucking cool uh, gift there. Um, bet, 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 from. Okay, all right. Let me say this now. I already feel, I feel bad. I feel bad about this. I, 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 and this is going to be a, a recurring thing here. Where I'm having a hard time remembering with some of this, like who gave me what gift. Yeah, I was just, I, again, I was meeting a lot of people. There was a lot of people like giving me stuff and I'm like, oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm, I, ha I was also having a hard time remembering people's uh, na names as hard as I was, as I was trying, like who, like who was who and all, and all that. I'm eating the, the cheese Wolf gave me on a gr Oh, that's fuck. Oh, um. Oh. Why do you have to rub it in, man? Okay, I th I think that this gift is is from uh Sfilzy. I I might I might be wrong. Uh if 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 you if you gave me this this gift and and you are not Sfilzy, please please let me know that. But this is among one of the uh <laughs> One of the the more clev cleverer uh, mm, gifts that I received, I I, I want to say. Um, insanity! I can't eat the cheese, man. It's rancid. It's it's fucking totally rancid. I wish I could. Maybe maybe you know what? I'll wait a couple weeks. Maybe I'll put it back in the car, and then I'll wait till it has like that little Kasu Marzu thing going on. You know what I'm talking about? And then then I'll, then I'll dig in. Because it's not a delicacy that people are willing to pay hundreds of dollars for uh, until there's until there's actually physically maggots in it. So we'll wait till there's actual maggots, then I'll eat the fuck the fucking cheese, right? Um, it was feelsy. Thank you, Lich. So this is official uh, TMG 2018 butt butter. Uh, that's. <laughs> It's been uh, tenderly, lovingly uh, collected from all of the sweaty, fucking gross, swampy asses, uncleaned asses that were floating around the convention center. Uh, as you can see, it is very... Um, you, you, you might think that butt butter would have like a kind of a smoother consistency, but it doesn't. It's actually quite chunky. Because, you know, this is what people forget. It's the result of... Butt butter is the result of people having very poor personal hygiene. So you better believe it's chock full of berries. Dingleberries. It's... <laughs> it's cookie butter uh, with the... With the, 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 the label uh, printed and, 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 and put over it. However... Oh, 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 there's more. Oh, I, I didn't even see this at the con. Hold on a second. Fresh and delicious. Our butt butter is hand harvested from the sweaty, tender butts of TMG 2016 nerds. 
Made just for you, Jabroni Mike. How fucking sweet is that? Please, no fridge. Please. Do not refrigerate the butt butter. Do not feed the butt butter after midnight. Do not get the butt butter wet. This is so fucking cool. Uh, serving size. One mouthful of, of gooey goodness. Mm -hmm. Gets my chops watering. There's also a QR code. And I vaguely remember asking what 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 the QR code was for. And then I got an answer, but immediately forgot the answer. So... Maybe scan it? I don't know. Go, go for it. Take a screenshot. Scan that shit. That might work. That'll work, right? That should work. Here, let me keep it still. Whatever. I, I, I don't know. I'll, I'll scan it at some point and find out what the fuck. It pro probably... Go oh, uh, it goes to one of her blogs, Twitter or Tumblr. That's cool. Yeah. Um... Moving through the, the pile here. There's so much more. You guys are really generous. Um, Bubba Fair. Realizing that I was short one mug after... Um, I believe it was one of the Mario uh, Mario Galaxy uh, streams. Where a mug, a mug got smashed. Yeah. I, I, what, what, again, what stream was that? Why did I smash a mug? What was the context of that? I, I couldn't remember. In, in, in any case, Bubba Fair replaced the mug. Thank you, Bubba. Nerds rule! <laughs> yeah! Sick! <laughs> However, that was my mother's mug that I broke. That mug wasn't even mine, so I actually have to replace my mug. I, I have to give her a new mug. I feel like she's not going to like this one that much. She's not a nerd. She's also not gay, but let's not go over that again. That, but that's that's been that's been discussed enough times. Um, maybe she will like it. I, I don't I don't know. She's not speaking to me right now because I'm destroying all of her fucking kitchenware. So okay, it's not like I can just ask her. It was the Odyssey. It was the turnaround with Bowser per, per Curiosa. Per Curiosa was a lot of fun to hang out with. The too many games. You all were a lot of fun to hang out with. I mean, I, let me just talk about the, the, the convention itself for a second. Um, so, the, the you, you know, I, I had a panel. Most of you know I had a panel. Uh, but I didn't think there was going to be anybody there because it was 2.30 on the first day. I figured, like, oh, well, you know, like, most people aren't even getting there till till, till Saturday. Uh, also, a lot of people, like, check in for the hotels. It, it's not till, like, like 3, 3 o'clock, 3.30. So in my mind, this was just going to be an empty panel. It was going to be like a couple of people. We would just sit around, bullshit, whatever. So I didn't prepare for it. Because why, you know... Because who the fuck's going to come, right? And then I get there, and the room was was packed. There, there, some, some people were standing. Now, I don't know if that meant that there were empty seats. There's, there's pictures. Do you see empty seats in those pictures? I don't I don't want this to sound like I'm I'm bragging, but it it was it was fucking awesome because everybody fucking came and packed this thing. I said I asked on social media, I said, would you guys like try to make it for this panel? And, and, and fucking you did. Um BK saying there there were a few empty seats. Okay. Alright, so it wasn't a full it wasn't a full room. How many people were, were in there, would you say? Like how many people? Like what was the? Because it was one. It was one of the smaller rooms. Let's like let's let's temper this. It was one of the smaller rooms. It wasn't a. It wasn't a. Uh, it was like 60, 70, Lich says. Okay, which is fucking amazing. I think that's amazing that 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 I was able to, to do that and and that and that more more more. I should say it was amazing that you guys did that for me. Like I think a lot of you. I, my assumption is a number of you said like, "Yeah, fucking, let's make sure we get there early so we could see this asshole's panel," and and shit. Thank you because that was one of the coolest fucking like this this whole weekend. Seriously, was one of the coolest, maybe the single coolest weekend of my fucking life. And it was just like to to see a visual confirmation of like you know all, all those people physically there in front of me who came to to see me like that. That just it just felt good. Like it was uh, yeah, it was like an ego stroke, but it also just I don't know. It, it felt like um, I don't know. It made me really emotional. Uh, guys, thank you for making that successful. Really, 
for like from the bottom of, of my heart and and tits and and bussy. Uh, what's this? O D Jones. Thank you, Jones, for the resub. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Well, no, Superfly, I had to fill an hour and I didn't prepare for it, so it was a little bit of a disaster. Because uh, <laughs> I'm sitting there and I'm looking at the full, and I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm still in shock because, like I said, I did not expect that to be like a nearly, nearly, yeah, full room. And I'm like, oh, well, what did these people expect to see? I'm looking at them, I'm like, I don't know what you thought, like, this was gonna be. Like, I don't know why you. <laughs> like, I don't know why you came here. Like, what do you. Like, shit, because now, now I'm like on the spot. Like, now there's pressure, because I, I don't know what. Fuck! Because I didn't. Pre we prepared a little bit, uh, Om Seal and Sick, and I believe uh, some of the um, Discord members helped me out with. Like, they, they made a, a trivia game for me. That was cool. Uh, we did a little bit of a, a, of a trivia game thing. Hold on, Diamond Down. Free up to the family. It's good to see you at the con. Also, bun time. Back to the family. Good to see you as well at the con. Um, it feels he's happy. I like the butter. Good. I I might I might eat it, even though like I know that that's not butt butter. That it's cookie butter. Just the fact that the the implication that it might be like fucking like like ass paste. Just kind of I don't know <laughs> I don't know if I can get over that. Gambit. Back to the family. Salad bake the suit. I wore two suits to too many games. I was able to do the whole thing for under $300. Two blazers, uh, some shirts. I got everything on sale. I did really good with the, with, with the suits. Although I'm told that it's from Express. And I'm told that Express uh, kind of... It's not very durable. Like, you don't get a lot of use out of it before it starts falling apart. That's part of the reason why it doesn't cost that much. But whatever. I, I, I'm not... Don't, don't get me annoyed about it. Um... Don't make me think about it. Hold on. Bap, 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 gambit. Uh, welcome back to the fan, the fan blow. Mashu Mira says, "Shit, I'd go, I'd go to just stare at Mike as he aw awkwardly flounders for an hour." Yeah, good, cause that's what it was. Uh, it was a disaster. No, it wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't a disaster. Everybody said that they, they they had a really good time, unless they were lying because they didn't want me to feel bad, which is a distinct yeah, it's a distinct possibility. I am I am aware of that. Um, what the fuck else did I want to, uh, did I want to fucking say about the, 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 the fuck, the panel, uh, did, did this happened at the panel, where I was, like, in the middle of answering somebody's question, because he did a Q&A, of course, and I'm in the middle of a question, and I kind of fucking forgot what I was saying, and then everybody's staring at me, and they're like, what's, like, wrong with him, is he high, and then I was like, does anybody remember what I'm saying, I'm like, anybody, does anyone remember what, what the fuck, arm sealed, do you remember what I was saying? <laughs> Do you remember what I was saying, man? I was like, I wasn't done talking about that. Sal Miyaki, welcome back to the family. It was so good to see you at the con, Sal Miyaki, who gave me uh, chocolate with licorice inside of it, which I can't show you because I ate all of it because it was fucking delicious, uh, which is uh, Sal Miyaki, uh, a Finnish treat. Uh... But yeah, it was a, it was a good time. Um, it, it, I just again, I wish I had prepared for it more. I didn't expect all those people to be there. Um, how how many? Well, Sal Miyaki and every, everybody here who who I saw at the con. How many people were like fucking disappointed to meet me? Like how many people were just like, oh, that was fucking like that was lame. Like oh, I thought he was gonna be cool. You know how they say like don't meet your your heroes because then or or whatever. I know I'm not, not that I'm anybody's hero, but that that idea that. If you if you think somebody's cool and then you meet them, and then you're like disappointed, like did that happen to anybody? Was, was it just like lame to meet me? Like did I just suck? Like was I just total shit? Like, <laughs> like who's like who's disappointed? I went to too many games. I flew across the country. I spent all this fucking money to meet this asshole, and he's just he's just he's just an idiot. Like it was just a total letdown. Like that, like who feels like that? Who wants their money back? Triple Horatio <laughs> didn't go, but I'm still disappointed. Hungry Spy, <laughs> Hungry Spy says, I was only disappointed the first time. Right, because the second time, you knew what you were in for. Right, right. Um, Larvesta Bot says that I drew a cock in their mouth. I don't know what you're... I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you mean. Can I, I show that image on, on screen? 
Nah, you know, let's not. Maybe someone can link a, Gia a, a Giazzo or whatever, or an Imgur link, so you can see what the... Lord Vestabot wasn't able to make the con, so... Um, who... who uh, s someone... Again, I'm sorry. It was hard for me to remember everybody. Uh, somebody had a um, some art that they wanted me to sign uh, for Lord Vestabot, and it included uh, Lord Vestabot's, like, little... Uh, you know, the Pokemon with, this, with the sombrero. And uh, I signed it, but I also added some additions to the art bk gifting a sub to star tacker star tacker family bk thank you for the gift uh bk also had a great time at, at, at the con everybody had a good time um i don't think anybody had like a bad time and if you had a bad time at the con it's probably because you didn't get to uh to hang out with me at all Ivan wants me to tell the chat how I like to steal Sharpies. If I took anybody's fucking Sharpie, it was an accident. This happens at conventions. There's a lot of shit going on, okay? All right? I'm fucking signing things, and there's Sharpies all over the place. All right? They become, like, communal. If you take Sharpies to a convention, all right, just go with the understanding that you might not be leaving with it because things happen. All right? I brought, like, ten Sharpies. They're all gone. All right, so I, I lost in that, too. I might have been up a Sharpie at one point, but I'm down, like, like a million. I'm down a mil I brought a million Sharpies to the con. And I came back with one. All right, so I don't want to hear it. Uh, I, the Star Heaven, I think, was able to maintain all his crayons. So I meet, I meet Star Heaven for the first time. Uh, I've known Star Heaven for, like, oh, uh, three years. Maybe, like, even a little bit, a little bit over three years at this point. Uh, Star Heaven comes in with he's like oh I brought, you know, I brought some crayons in case anybody wants to do art and uh we're in the hotel uh one of the hotel rooms just hanging out having a little you know little orgy or whatever and uh, that didn't happen it's a joke he's got this massive tub of of crayons and i i couldn't fucking i could not believe it. i'm like oh he brought like five crayons right he brought crayons he's like well, fuck five five crayons it's 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 a fucking like industrial sized tub of fucking crayons. He opens the top. There's crayons in it. It's a sea of crayons. And I immediately, I just dive my hand in and start mixing them around. And he's looking at me, enjoying that. He's like, yep, that's, he's like, that's, yeah, that's what everybody does. Just, just get in. It just feels very aesthetically pleasing to just kind of just move your fingers through this, this sea of crayons. And then, yeah, art was made with the crayons, which I have. A lot of art. A lot of art. A lot. A lot of art here. Uh, sick today. Yeah, if you got picks, you could toss them in. Uh, toss them into the chat so people can can can, can look at them. Um, the fuck was I gonna say? Oh yeah, if I, I was trying to do this too. If you took a picture with me at at, at the con, because I kind of want to keep all the pictures I took with people. If you took a pic with like with me, we're together in, in the picture. Can you just uh, like email it to me? I, I'm 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 trying to c compile all of them so I can just I don't know. I just want them. Uh, Muncho. Welcome back to the family, much. Uh, which crayon is the best flavor? I don't know, man. I, I ate a lot of them. They all start mixing together at some point. Yeah, I'm gonna get to I'm gonna get to Yattermang's Lich. Um, some of Star Heaven's uh, crayon art in the flesh. It was really cool to 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 meet you, Star. I don't I don't think you're here right now, but it was very cool to finally. Uh, me and Star Heaven have, me and Star Heaven uh, were in the Ark Tribe together. So, needless to say, there's a lot of memories. Uh, Ghost Host, welcome back to the family. Ghost Host, I also met at the con, and Ghost Host was um, really wanted to get uh, their Red Vox album signed, and I fucking Ghost Host waited in in the lobby of the convention center. I I said on Twitter, uh, he asked me, "Are you gonna be there on Sunday?" I said yes, but I but I didn't say what time. And then when I do walk in, it was probably around like I feel like it was like one or one thirty-two. Uh, I walk in and 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 he's there, and I'm like, were you just like standing here like waiting all day like for me to for for me to come in so you could get these signed? And he's like, yeah, kinda. And I felt really bad. Uh, I'm sorry I did that to you, ghost. But I love that. Like you wanted that signed that bit. I, I'm just. I'm, it was flattering that you, <laughs> that you were willing to 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 do that. I'm really sorry. I I should have said like what time. I'm a dick. Uh, there were a lot of unintentional dick moves. I think that I pulled at at this convention, and I I I just want to apologize 
if uh, I somehow true blue I did I did get the email thank you that was very useful yeah I'm gonna dig into that when I have some more time uh Sen what's up good to see you BK gifted a sub to buff pretty Riku who I also met welcome to the family Riku BK thank you for the gift bud uh pop 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 oh wait where were we crayon art sick today apple Dave of course micro gravity Natalie thank you for the bite uh Hammy Sam, Star Heaven's Pig OC. Needs no needs no introduction here. Show us the pick the pick. You emailed it to me, Bun Time. Yeah. Um. If you okay, so just I'll do it. Later on, after I get through this this mountain of gifts, I'll go in the email and we'll look through all that stuff. Because um, there's a lot of really good pictures that I remember seeing them on Twitter and being like, "Yeah, I want, yeah, I want that. I want, I want that." This is a uh, an image that took place at the panel, which, by the way, I, I wanted to stream, but what ended up happening was uh, my screen wave rep, who was who was going to get me, we had talked about getting the Wi-Fi uh, password for the convention center. Um, he wasn't able to get me the password like in time for for the panel. I got it after, yeah, I got it after the panel, which is why I was able to stream it all uh, at at the con. Um, but you know what? I'm not I'm not upset about it. Right, a little bit because I did want to have a recording of it. I wanted a vod of it, but um, they were so fucking busy, uh, the Screenwave people. And I also want to just like I I, I have I have to thank them, especially my Screenwave uh, rep Brandon. Um, who, who, like, honestly, he busted his ass to make all of that happen for me. And I, I really appreciate it. Because, again, it was, it was fuck one of the best, yeah, weekends uh, of, of my life. And uh, he really, yeah, I, I, whenever I saw him, he was doing, like, 50 different things. So I completely understand why um, I wasn't able to get that, to get that password. But they really busted their ass. They put on an awesome con. Um, and I'm hoping that... Um, Next year, I'll be able to... If, 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 if I get a panel next year, uh, I'll be able to stream it. I also wanted to ask if anybody recorded it, like on the off chance that there was anybody there who was actually able to record the whole thing. I would really love to have that. So if you did that, shoot me an email about it. Riku, thank you for that pipe there. Uh, the Mitch Azor. Welcome to the family, Kane. Welcome back to the family. Uh, yeah, if you got clips even, uh, Little Bun, send them over. Anything you got related to that, <coughs> to that panel, uh, please send it on over. Email it to me. Oh, that'd be tit. Oh, my, but, uh, hold on a minute. There was one art, piece of art in particular I wanted to, um, I wanted to share with you guys. At some point, I think it was Thursday night, we were hanging out in one of the hotel rooms, and I was, uh, I, I wanted to, I wanted to draw something with the crayons, but I didn't know what to draw. And I think it was, uh, I think it was Bun Times said, draw, draw a rabbit, or draw a bunny. Also, Jer uh, Jerge, I believe, all seconded that. So I was like, all right, I guess I'm drawing a rabbit. And then, like, I started drawing it, and I don't know, the head, like, it looked stupid. And I'm like, this isn't really a rabbit anymore. And then I, I don't know, I did some, I, I just gave it tentacles to try to, like, maybe I could turn it into a squid or something. And then that just, like, that was a failure. So then I just like gave it a, a, a chicken body. And then uh, I left it there and I said, if anybody wants to add to this thing, uh, you could go ahead and add and, and, add <laughs> and just tack on body parts or whatever the hell, whatever the hell you want to do. So here's a communal uh, art project that, that I think uh, ultimately went fantastic. Uh, I don't know what this fucking thing is, but I feel like we should probably kill it with fire. Bird, rabbit, uh, squid, motherfucker. I got, I, it's a chicken, rabbit, squid. There's a lot going on here. You can see the rabbit face. Like, I made the rabbit face, and everybody was like, you fucked up, asshole. It looks like a dog. Like, do you even know what a rabbit looks like? That is, I believe, I, I heard, I heard uh, asked at, at one point. So, yeah. Um, community art project. Project, hope you like it. <laughs> That's someone's new furry OC. <laughs> Vinehart says, yeah. It's kind of like, maybe this should be like the channel mascot, because it kind of represents, um, in a, in a way, or at least a certain collection of us. Maybe it could be, uh, yeah, like a, 
maybe an emote or, 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 or some shit at some point. I, I, I don't know. But in any case, uh, yeah, d please, please, please do not make R34. It's very new. I feel like we should keep it pure. So resist the temptation of, of you know, drawing this thing with it with a dick or whatever. Let's just leave it. Let's just keep it pure. Like for once with with one thing one time. Can we keep it pure? Black bear like once just just once just with one just with this one thing, please Too late <laughs> Yeah, I bet Um. All right, let me let me do this real quick It says Super Michael <clears throat> I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do the voice right now you number one. You, uh, you number one. You put. What does that say? I have a hard time with that. You put. You. You put, man. Anyone? You pal. Oh, your pal, Mario, right? And then and then C M Charles Martinet. There you go. It said, you're not the number one. You suck a dick. Why did you show me that video of you say you suck my dick? And then again, I didn't show him the video. I shook his hand. Um, I said, listen, you know, you're, you're, you're an inspiration. And, uh, you know, I think it because I, I was at his uh, panel for about 20 minutes. He had a panel and um, man, what a fucking insightful guy he is really. Like I'm listening to him talk. First of all, uh, I was there for the Q&A bit. And there were actually a lot, a lot of good questions. Like, I don't think I heard any, any, any bad questions. People were going up asking him. Like, I'm, I'm glad, though. I'm glad that he didn't get any, like, really stupid. I, I think I heard one person ask him if he was, like, upset about Waluigi not being in Smash. Like, that, that's, that, you're gonna waste that opportunity? You can fucking ask him anything? You fucking ask him about Waluigi in, in, in Smash? Come on. But, uh, he had an answer. He was like, if they ever make a Waluigi game, like, I'd love to do the, you know, I'd love to do the voice for it. But uh, he had a number of really interesting uh, answers to questions. Uh, one of them that stuck with me was, and I, 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 need, I need to seek out more of, of uh, seeing this guy speak because he's just fucking, he's got so many good like ideas about things and stuff. Um, but someone asked him like, listen, you're a very, you know, outwardly, like you're a very, very happy guy. And you, you know, you just bring, you bring a lot of happiness to people. You've always got an upbeat attitude and stuff. Um, but what do you do if you ever go to the, to, to like a, a dark place? You know, do you ever go to a dark place? And what do you do when you're at, like, a dark place? Like, what the fuck? Like, I mean, you know, I, I probably wouldn't have thought to ask him something like that. But again, you think about it for a second. Good question. And he said, like, well, when that happens to me, you know, what I like to do is I like to think about, um, you know, all the positivity uh, that 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 I've, that I've you know, like, brought to people and the, the joy that I've brought to people and the, the, good, the good that I've done and things like that. And I think that uh, that, that was something that, f for me, as a creative person, was probably a really important important takeaway um it was yeah it was a really emotional like well well thought out answer that he gave and um i just fucking i just love this guy and he also got into like talking about um you know be, being critical of yourself as a creative person and uh, and had to, and had to deal with that like he went he went into that type of a thing too how he's took he's always got like a critical eye that like you know will sometimes try to tell him that you know what he's doing is bad or or it's not funny or it's not a good performance and like how he how he deals with that and you're like wow one of the most successful voice actors in fuck video gaming history or, or whatever and he's still you know he's like looks like i don't know how old he is he's probably in his 70s but um yeah he's, with a long career behind him he's still dealing with that shit i thought that that was really interesting you know um, what a cool fucking guy in his, in his, in his fifties. What, what, whatever, Black Bear, leave me, leave me the fuck alone. All right. <laughs> What's give or take 22, two decades. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I mean, yeah. And when he signed near all the characters, he did the, he did the voices for them. Uh, there was a lot of bipe that I missed. I don't want to be a dick about this. Hang out. Who biped? True Blue Review. Thank you for the bite. Uh, Squiggly. Back to the family. Uh, but, but, no, I didn't show him the video. I didn't show him any videos. I didn't show him any. I did not ask for his blessing. I told you that was a joke and I wasn't going to do that. Uh, but, 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 hallucinating honeybees. Back to the family. You number one. 
No, he was in uh, he was in a good mood. He looked like he was a little annoyed cuz I mean, you know, it, listen, uh, 3 days out of convention and 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 like he's meeting people. I, I met him on Sunday, so it was like the end. He's like, you know, you, you get you get fatigued, right? So What is he saying? So it says, "Woohoo!" What is uh, Wario saying? Yo ho! I don't exact. I can't really. Yeah, I can't. I can't read it. But whatever. He's a fucking cool guy. There was something else that I was trying to that somebody asked him, and I'm trying to fucking remember. But I don't know. Is it gone? Is it gone? Wait. Well, uh, wait. Yep, we're doing this. Wait. No, I want to remember this. Crossbone. Feel back to the family. Wesley Snipes wants to know what's up with the suit. I just dress like this all the time. From now on, yeah, I'm just gonna dress. I'm just gonna dress like this all the time. Oh yeah, he was talking about his early career, uh, and you know how how hard it was for him to get uh, to get to get work. And for years, he was just sending out uh, you know samples of his, of his portfolio, voice acting, with cover letters and things like that. And for years, the only call he got was somebody like wanted to know where he got the stationery done for it. So it's like uh, you know trying to trying to do to do thing uh, do creative things and and having it you know having having a tough time like getting started and things like that. He gives you a lot to think about um, as a, as as a creative person, which is why I really loved uh, the, getting the chance to listen to this guy talk. Really fucking cool dude. Definitely uh, one of the, one of the highlights. Easy D says that I need a cum suit. Yeah, we're doing that now. Uh, Lich Pit says, even if Mike forgets to shout me out, I did all of his everything <laughs> for the entire weekend, so you're all welcome. Uh, Lich Pit was my uh, personal assistant, uh, se secretary, uh, bodyguard, uh, security person, um, the fluffer, like literally <laughs> every. <laughs> Every uh, I wouldn't have been able to do any of, of what I did uh, if it wasn't for uh, for Lich Pit. So Lich Pit, you are the fuck the fucking, you are the inarguable best ever of of anything or anyone ever. And thank you, um, so much. Everybody, please also should thank uh, Lich Pit now that now that she got everybody's attention. In a very, just kidding. Um, no, seriously, Lich Pit was was a lifesaver. Uh, when people gave me shit, like she was, she was lugging around an empty suitcase, and every time somebody gave me something, she she would like put it in there. By the end of the day, the suitcase weighed more than I I would have been able to carry. You know, like that was very uh, yeah, that was very cool, and I probably didn't deserve it. So Lich Pit, thank you for for doing that for me. You you are the best. Um, my caregiver, M Michizor, uh, she also like like wiped my ass and like dre dressed me and, and and made sure that like like I ate. She did the thing with the spoon and the and the airplane to make sure I was getting food inside inside my body. Um, there was some yeah. What the fuck? I'm so scatterbrained, man. I hate it. It's because there was a long weekend and so many things happened and there was so much there was so much shit um, that I wanted to get to that I don't I probably should have wrote wrote it all down but but you know <laughs> as as everybody learned at the panel I don't like to prepare for, for things um, let me see what else is in the pile here pop 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 we got of course some video games. Now, hold on. On Saturday, I was able to do a signing at the Screenwave booth. Another another shout out to Screenwave Media for allowing me to do that. Like to have a place where I could sit and you know meet people, and shake hands, and take pictures. Lich Pit, by the way, was also the uh, the, the photographer for the con. Every time somebody wanted a picture, she took it. Um, one might say too many games uh for his mx too many games again this is one of those times where i get concerned that people may have spent too much money on me uh bubba fair seriously uh went overboard here the hat which i think i'm gonna wear uh for every stream forever now uh if i do face cam i'm gonna have this hat on because i just uh i love it and it's also 
like very high quality. This was this was not a cheap hat by any means. And I believe uh, it, you you could change what it says on the hat, but I'm I'm not I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna do that. Top nep, it's there for a reason. It was it, this this was Bob Affair, Dragisha. Uh, this was also Bob Affair. Imagine. Party babies. <laughs> I, 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 I've seen this before. And my question is... I get, you know, like when you put a Z on the end of something to make it plural, it, it like, it makes it cooler than if you did it with an S. But the plural of this word needs to end in I-E-S. So like... Can you not do that and put the Z on the end of it and have that be cool? Because as, as far as I'm concerned, that says babas. Babas. Doesn't say baby, it says babas. This game received, yes, uh, 7.5 on IGN, Wesley Snipes, which is a uh, significantly higher score than Hyperdimension Neptunia did. So I think it's... <laughs> at some point, we'll have to check this out. So I could stop having it being accused of not playing good games on my channel. There's also this. Oh boy. Uh, we'll get back to Hannah Montana. Wild animals, dolphins. All right. Blowholes not included. Fuck. Cake Mania 3. Uh, which it, it's titles like like these that make me think that maybe like Bubba Fair didn't <laughs> didn't spend that much money, which makes me feel better about it. Holly Hobby. I mean, what? What the fuck do you do in this game? I'm I'm like I'm I'm scared of some of these. Tragicomical says Holly. <laughs> Chibi Robo Ziplash, which I believe is actually um this is supposed to be a like a like a pretty damn good game if I'm not mistaken. Uh yeah who yeah I, Holly Hobby. <laughs> Polly Pocket get fucked. Holly Hobby's the new bitch in town. Is it a bootleg? Oh, there. Oh, we have to get into bootlegs for a second. Yeah. There were some delightful bootlegs in too many games. Horses. Two. Horse girls rejoice because we're going to be streaming this live on the Jabroni Mike channel. In preparation of the chant. Uh, not ch yeah, it's chance, chance the horse. Uh, batting cages YouTube video, which uh, we're getting there. We're getting there slowly. We're getting, we're getting there. Please, please be mature about this. Uh, hmm. What else we got? Marine rescue. Paws and claws. Marine marine rescue. Which I don't know. It feels it feels fake. Like, it feels like some kind of, uh, like, a joke game. Like, you put it in the, the DS and you start it up. And, uh, you know, it's it's trying to, it's telling you to go rescue the animals, but there's no, there's no rescue equipment. You just have a wooden club. And it says, click here to rescue. And there's, like, a little X on the fucking, on the seal's skull. And you just start clicking it. And it's like, oh, my God, what are you doing? And you just start clubbing it, but you can't do anything else. Because look, look how fake this looks. This looks like a fake game. Oh, cause it, ah, THQ. Oh shit, didn't THQ develop that weird, uh... The one that I did a highlight video of that time? When you're trying to like, you're trying to like find a boyfriend or some shit? What was that fucking, that... What was that fucking game, that piece of shit? Ivan says, speaking of horse cock, did you ma Yeah, there was, um, yeah, at one point, there was there was someone walking around with, I, I, I imagine, a bad dragon dildo. You guys told me about it. I never saw the dildo. Um, but then after, I was, I was kind of like, 
I had a thought after you guys told me that. Like, what if what if that person sees me and wants that signed? Like, is that that's not something that that's out of the realm of possibility. Like, that could totally happen. Like, do I do I sign it? In that case, like what? I signed a lot of weird shit. I signed a donut at one point. It's not out of the realm of possibility that like someone would ask me to sign a dildo. I mean, <laughs> didn't happen. It didn't happen. It didn't happen. But the dildo was was in attendance. Dora saves the the snow princess. Yeah, it's the door of the Explorer game. Bubba Fair, if you're here, like, do you do you actually expect me to play all these? They still have the donut, Nick. Nick, who <laughs> who wanted the donut signed? Please don't eat that donut. Please, I feel like those markers might be might be toxic. Based on you know the fact that I was like getting high off of them all day. Somebody said that the I looked high in one of the pictures that they took with me. And it's probably because I was sniffing markers for the, for at least 45 minutes before that picture was taken. It was Lord Gubby. Gubby, please tell me you didn't eat the donut. Well, I mean, what do you do with the donut at that point? Like, just throw it in the garbage? You can't throw it out. It's fucking memory. I signed that. That's a personal insult to me. Now, if you throw that fucking donut out, you have to keep that donut. At all costs. Maybe get like a dedicated refrigerator for it. Imagine Rockstar, a vacuum chamber. Yeah, Circle Bobby. <laughs> what the fuck is this garbage? Oh my fucking Christ. Is that Grimes? Is that Grimes? It's Grimes, you plays Grimes? <laughs> Bridezillas. I think we're gonna have to play this one. I think I'm gonna, yeah, I think. I think that one's a lock. I think that one's a fucking lock. Guys, there, there, there's like a million more games here. You know what? Let's let's take a bootleg break. Uh, I believe Lich Pit found this gem at one of the booths. Break so bad. Danger funny. So, what you have is, uh, I guess it's a Breaking Bad bootleg, huh? Yeah. But you might notice that that's Brian Cranston from, uh, like, a, like, a, like I, I guess from some promotional material for uh, Mal Malcolm in the Middle. Yeah, so I'm imagining like a, a version of, of of Breaking Bad where like you know there's a meth lab explosion, and you know there's fight, it's very gory. Somebody's walking around with like one of their arms blown off, and there's a laugh track playing. I mean, what what the person who bootlegged this? This is a, a part of me thinks that this is ironic, because if you're trying to bootleg Breaking Bad, you, you probably know that it's not supposed to be funny, that it's a drama, yeah. There is some, there is some material on the back. With the cancerous concern, lonely men must use chemistry skill in making most potent of drugs, methamphetamine. Danger and serious threat comes to man's family to bring his life to serious impact. So you read that, and then you're like, oh shit! Oh fuck, oh! I, got, I gotta watch this now! So you buy the DVD, you take it home, you open it up, you pop it in the DVD player, and then you see that uh, Shaft in Africa uh, st starts, starts up. You're watching Shaft in Africa. Yeah, you're not you're not watching you're not watching break so bad. Much to your dismay and disappointment. Turns out what you actually purchased was Shaft in Africa. And there's two DVDs. The other one is uh Shaft's big score. Which you could see in the in the ring there. Um or you know, for all we know. 
That might not be what's on those DVDs. There could be fucking horse porn on here. It could be fucking Mr. Hands, like extended version. I, I don't, I don't fuck, we have no fucking idea what that is. I'm a little afraid to put it in my, in my DVD player, but I kind of really, really wanted to see, like, yeah, some, some kind of Breaking Bad, like, remake, where the, the people, like, you know, obviously different actors and everything from, I guess that's, uh, I guess that's, I don't know what language that is. Uh, some One of the Chinese languages, or maybe Korean. I, I have no idea what that is. I don't think it's Japanese, but... I've been wrong about that before and everybody called me a racist so you know that's I'm, I'm, that's why i'm hesitant to like even guess it's an asian fucking character language shut up but i kind of was really looking forward to seeing a uh yeah like a remade breaking bad that's all fucked up <laughs> where they think it's funny but people are fucking like dying of heroin overdoses but they're trying to do it in a funny way i'm bummed out that this isn't real is what I, is what i'm saying i, I really would have i really would have enjoyed that man um, it's Canadian, Ploptipus. <sighs> right. Right. Before I move on from the Bubba Fair gifts, really quickly. Some of you may have seen that I did, in fact, stream from too many games. I streamed from the arcade area. Where they set up all the, uh, the, the the games. There's arcade games, there's console games. They have tournaments and everything. It's really, really fucking cool. And uh, on on Saturday, Bubba Fair. Sorry, on on Friday. Yeah, no, on Saturday, Bubba Fair challenged me to a uh, a Mario Kart race. And what happened during this race? I I have to say, uh, it really it really bummed me out. Um, it was almost like for that entire day afterwards, it was sort of like. You know that stereotypical, like, middle-aged, uh, small-town, like, dude who, who played on the on the high school football team, and he had, like, you know, that one game or that one pass that, like, he needed to make to win the fucking championship, and he fucked it up. And then for the rest of his life, like, he's just fucking getting drunk and constantly talking about it. That was the headspace that this losing this match put me in. Like, I kept thinking about it and bitching about it. So, I, and what happened in the match was I went off the course and I had assumed that I was like, all right, so now I got to wait for like the lack of two to, to come fuck pick me up or whatever. And then, so I leaned my head back in frustration, right? And everybody was like, what are you doing? So I, I, I'd see, like, there was course underneath there, like, underneath where I fell off. So I was just sitting there, like, with my eyes closed, like, waiting for the Lackey 2 animation to end. And I just could have kept going. And that's the only reason, Bubba, that I lost the first match. I want you to know that. It's the only, I actually, I, like, I, fuck, I fucking heard him. Like, I heard him. I heard him. Right? So I'm thinking about it. I'm getting pissed off. And then on Sunday, I, I see, you know, if, if he wants to do a rematch. You could see the VOD, by the way, if you go look on the, on the, the this channel's, uh, the videos section. The VOD, the VOD is there if you want to see it. The quality is not great, but I was streaming it from my cell phone again. But, uh, it's a lot, a lot of dropped frames and shit. It's pretty gross. You saw it, end day, end day. back to the family. There was a win condition. Bubba Fair said if, uh, if he won, I was going to have to play this shitty hannah montana plug and play thing which I, I have no fucking idea what it even entails all i know is the hannah montana like leave me alone um but you'll see in the vod excuse me that was you probably audible if you see in the vod i did redeem myself i beat him i came in i came in first place i did i won mm. Mm. I don't I don't win very often, so it feels really fucking good when I win, man. Like, let me relish it, you know? And I said, I'm going to play the fucking thing anyway. So here it is. I'll play it anyway. Everybody wins. Yay! I'm going to play the fucking thing. I'm sure it'll be just awful. And everybody will have a great time. Uh, what else? Okay. Here's the thing that went on. During my panel, uh, and this, this is this is fucked up. All right, this is fucked. Let me start by saying that I, I'm very upset about this. I'm very upset about this, and I apologize in advance to this person. But um, 
during the panel, somebody uh, somebody came up to the to the front and gave me a bu a bunch of shit. Now, you will see what it is shortly, but rest assured, a lot of money was 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 spent here. And I asked them what their name what, what, what was, and they said I heard Nick. There was a lot of shit going on. It was it's very confusing in that moment. Um, I'm flustered. I'm also like a little bit. I'm a little bit nervous because there's a whole fucking audience of people standing in front of me, and I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. So it's just it's very conflicting, fucked up thing. Um, so I missed like who it was who gave me this stuff. Four twenty six Max Wedgie. This was you. Because were you only there? Uh, you were only there Friday because I didn't see you. I was looking for you, man. Like the rest of the weekend, and I didn't see you. Everybody was looking for you. I fuck. I told, I told other mods. I said, please go in the Discord and try to find out who this person was because I feel really shitty that like I didn't get who this was. But it was 426 Max Wedgie. I'm so glad you, that, that that you're here. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for for all of this. I feel a little. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like you spent a lot, and again, like, I don't know how I feel about it. But uh, but this is really fucking awesome. Um, first up. I was given a cassette tape. Now, if you did tell me what was on this cassette tape, I forgot. I don't know. I don't know what's on it. I also do not have the means to listen to this cassette tape, as far as I know. I may have to go suss out some way to listen to it, but uh, rest assured, I at some point will. Is it your mixtape? Did you give me your mixtape? Hey, check out my mixtape. People don't make mixtapes anymore. You should have just gave me a link to your SoundCloud. Um, but that's not all I received from Max Wedgie. I also received fucking Splatoon 2. Not a cheap game. Uh, I had I was considering getting the game. I don't know if I eventually would have gotten it or or whatever. Um, but. Thank you. Holy shit. Uh, I do not deserve. I do not. I do not deserve to, to, ha to have this kind of money spent on me. I, I Listen, it's the type of thing where it's like subs, you know, like five dollars a month or, or whatever. OK, yeah. Um, the bits like here and there, a couple bucks like that's. Yeah. OK. Like sometimes I feel bad enough about that. Right. But but when you just go and splurge on me, it's like. But man, no, I do want it. I want it. Yeah, I want it. Yeah, yeah, I want it. And also the Octo expansion. Yeah, I want it. Yeah, yeah, I want it. I want it. Yeah. Thank you so much for do for doing this. Oh my God. Uh, I will of of course be streaming this. Um, I just gotta get good. It's a very competitive game, so you gotta you gotta get, you gotta get good. Um. Also, some other gems. Bootleg Garfield. The fast and the furriest. We will find out who indeed is the furriest. All right. With bootleg Garfield. How many people are pissed off that I'm calling Heathcliff, Heathcliff bootleg Garfield? Garfo. They should call him Garfoed. Because he's just a fake Garfield. Who's Black Bear? Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Oh, I knew you were going to fucking come to Heathcliff's defense. He's bullshit. Look at him. He's bullshit. He's a fucking blatant Garfield ripoff. Like, why? Who rips off something that, that that sucks in the first place? Like, what are you doing? Like, I'm just fucking with you, Black Bear. <laughs> just joshing you. Just joshing you. Just yanking your dick. Just yanking your dick a little bit. Just a little, little dick yank. <laughs> uh, there's more. Also, Max Wedgie, yeah, yeah. But um, the, you gave me the, this as well, right? I just want to make sure I'm not getting confused with, with, with someone else. But I'm pretty sure you also gave me Sonic Boom, Fire and Ice for the 3DS, which I think, I think we probably got to stream at some point. Man, I've heard, I've heard not good things ab ab about this, like that at, at all. Um, do you do you like it, Lugia? It's not bad. Well, I mean, after the Sonic Boom, uh, the Rise of Lyric experience, like this, this franchise, like I just, I don't know. Like again, I did, I did check out the cartoon. Uh, there were some episodes of it I actually, I actually really liked a lot. But that doesn't mean that the ga the games are, you know, are going to be good. Uh, this wasn't you, Max Wedgie. Um, was this you, Nick? Uh, it was Nick, Nick Delcat. I'm sorry, Nick. Thank you. 
I, I, yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna stream them. I think I'm gonna, I'm not gonna beat them. Someone, <laughs> someone in the panel asked, when, oh, when are you gonna, when are you gonna finish Sonic Boom? And I was like, oh, I did, I did finish Sonic Boom. Next, next question. Static, gifting a sub to Dragisha. Free to the family, Dragisha. Static, thank you for the gift, bug. Um, I will, Ivan. Thank you. Yeah, I want to I, I want to get to that eventually. Um, and this, yeah, the Shattered Crystal. So I got two Sonic Boom games here. Compliments of, of Nick Delcat. <laughs> Nick, do you like these games, or is this like, is this ironic? Like, you want me to play it, like, cause you, cause you enjoyed how how much I hated Sonic Boom. That's what that is, right? Um. Meanwhile, yeah, uh, they were all mixed together, Max Wedgie. That's why that went down like that. Uh, but 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 Max Wedgie also bought me another two games, and Max Wedgie said. Um, because I was trying to do the panel, I was like, I'll open them later. And Max Reggie said, open them on, on stream. So, I'm going to open them on stream as per the request, uh, Max Wedgie. Um, two more. Um, Switch games, it feels like. I have no idea what's in here. Um, also, uh, you wrapped them in... You wrapped them in, what, newspaper? Like coupon paper? Max. You sprint, you, you you splurge on the fucking games, then you can't buy wrapping paper. Fuck is this shit? Fuck is this? Come get them from me. Go buy wrapping paper, wrap them, and then give them back. All right, what do you think this is? <laughs> I jest, of course. Cream hearts, thank you for the uh, for the bite. Um. Let's see what's in here now. Bring them back and wrap them the right way. Blah. Dude, you did not. So you heard me talking about how I wanted to stream this. It's Doom. Oh, it's Doom. Yeah, I want it. I've been wanting this for a while. Ah, I want it. I feel bad, but I want it. Mac, uh, Max Wedgie, can you just like like lie to me and, and tell me that you 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 like you work for Google or something and you just like you're you're very rich so I don't have to feel just even just like make it up like even just be like yeah I work for yeah I work for for Google I'm fucking just I I I'm a multimillionaire like this is not putting me out just like just tell me that like just tell me oh uh, oh oh Vinny played Doom shut her down. Shut her down! Shut her down! Shut her down! I um, I got a chance to talk to Mike Mate over the uh, over the weekend, and uh, Mike Mate is is is, is streaming uh, on Twitch. If you didn't know, uh, he's got his <clears throat> his own uh, his his uh, Twitch channel, which uh, I can't. I give him a shout out, but it's I think it's Mike Mate Live mods. Can you help me out with that? Um, but he mentioned that he was. <laughs> He was doing something, and people in his chat were like, Joel did this first. And he was like, what is that like? Because, you know, he's primarily used to YouTube, which is a new thing for him. He's like, did, why, why were people telling me, like, Joel did it as if, like, I couldn't do it because because Joel did it? <laughs> and I explained to him the whole, the, the, the shutter down, like, the shutter down uh, emote, the shutter down situation. I'm like, yeah, you could use you could use it if you if you want. You might need it if you're gonna keep streaming on Twitch. Um, there it is, uh, um, Seal. Thank you for doing that. Uh, but yeah, Doom. Holy shit! Thank you so much. Uh, what else we got? Three, three Switch games, including the fucking Octo expansion for Splatoon. Tiny Barbarian from uh, Nicholas, right? Yeah. I don't know anything about this game. It looks cat, but being a huge fan of the Binding of Isaac, obviously, I think I'm I'm, I'm really looking looking forward to checking this out too. This is cool as shit. Thank you, Max Wedgie, so much for these gifts. Um, don't feel bad. I don't buy games for myself. All right, all right. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna not feel bad. Uh, thank you for that. Jesus, wow. Too much love. I don't deserve it. I don't. I don't I'm gonna keep saying I, that I don't no matter how much you guys say that I do so just that's that's how that is 
There's more stuff. There's more stuff. Uh, bat, bat, bat. This is another dick move. I forgot um, who gave me this, but it's a kind of a toilet candy, which is very appropriate for my, you know, my 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 potty humor. The po potty humor is the bread and butt of this bread, the <laughs> the bread and butt butter of this channel as you know uh so what's more appropriate than some kind of uh toilet toilet bowl candy dispenser interesting thing i also received this a similar gift last year from i believe this the same person right now last year <clears throat> long story short this spent the entire year <clears throat> in the trunk of my car underneath things, and I forgot that it was there. But when I was, <laughs> it's just, when I was cleaning out the car after this trip, or it was, in, it was like under one of my seats or something, it was somewhere in my car, I, I, I found this. And um, now they have been re <laughs> reunited again. Thank you, uh, wh whoever gave me this. Is the person who gave me this here? Uh, Bolomite. Uh, gifting a sub to Wise Lizard. Yeah, the family lizard, Bolomite. Thank you for the gift. Um, what else we got? We got a host from uh, from Rev. Rev, thank you so much for the host, bud. That game is looking real fun. Um, what what are you what are you playing? What's it called? Uh, home renovation DI DIY uh, fucking the home makeover. I saw you put in sledgeham uh, a sledgehammer through the through the dry, the, the dry drywall, and um, it looks like that's a that's a fun game to kind of just get out aggression. Uh, can you can you win by just leveling the, the fucking place? Like I, I want to know if you could destroy the entire house with the sledgehammer over the course of hours. Like I feel like I would not build in a game like that. Only destroy. House flipper is called house, house flipper. Uh, Rev, thank you, thank you for the host. Um, HGTV simulator, yeah. Uh, Buddhist, Buddhist sandwich. I feel like I want to, I want to try the game out and just level the fucking thing with my, the house with my bare hands. I feel like that'd be a really, a really great time. Um, I think that's the type of thing where some people look at that as, as like a Zen opportunity. You know, it's the kind of game where you just turn your brain off. Like have oh, painting the walls, have a good time, but you know. No, I'm gonna fuck. I'm gonna fucking destroy that place with my anger. Um. Okay. Some more art. This is from Yattermang. Really cool fucking piece. I want to make sure you can see it. Fuck. So what? You, what we got is. This is hard. A collection of memes. You got Nep Nep, you got Squan Dog, the Deeds, Melt Fast. Which which which? By the way, there was an ice there was a uh, an, an ice cream truck in front of my house today, and I ran out to see if he had the fucking Sonic ice cream, and he did not. So I'm still uh, that's still a work in progress. Also Funky Kong, uh, myself, Rember in the back there, and some really 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 fucking well done bean stains. Look at that bean. That, that's real beans, boy. See them beans? Oh, shit. Look at the fucking bean stains. Like, look at the fucking the love that went into those bean stains. Yatterman. This art is fucking awesome. Uh, and my 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 intention uh, is to maybe find a frame a frame for it. Um and see if I got a place to uh to to, to put it. Star Heaven, if I do that with all of your art, there's not going to be any wall space, <laughs> wall space left. Uh, also, I need room for this, which was done by... Fuck. Wait. Did they sign it? I think Captain Hungry Spy did this. Hungry Spy, I saw you in the chat earlier. Can you confirm if you, if you did this? I'm going to feel like an asshole if you didn't. But, but please... Please see... Oh, fuck. That reflection. You're not seeing shit with that reflection. Hold on. Uh, how do I show this? Turn off the monitor, right? All right, hold on. Hold on. 
there it is a i guess kind of an abstract impressionist myth to think it's fucking beautiful and i believe it was done with charcoal we were discussing a Mr. Dink uh, charcoal piece, which is appropriate. Because, you know, again, the, 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 the meme is, You broke my grill? And grills involve charcoal, I think. In any case, uh, very expensive art, Douglas. Very expensive. Was it Hungry Spy? I didn't see his answer because I turned the fuck the monitor off. <clears throat> Oh, it was Hungry Spy. Cool. Okay. Yeah. We're glad I <laughs> Like, what's more fucked up than accrediting art to the wrong person? But yeah. With the frame. So, yeah. I'm going to be just popping this right up there next to BJ. My boy BJ. Yadermang. Next time, buy a frame. All right. All right. All right. Don't be cheap. Don't be cheap, right? Of course, I'm joking. Imagine if I was really that big of an asshole. Again, fairly certain that this was purchased for me by Sfeelzy at, at the, the, the convention. But it's pretty relevant. Welcome to the family, son. A Resident Evil. I don't know if you can see it right now or not. Yeah, you can. Resident Evil Seven uh, shirt, featuring, of course, the the Baker family at uh, at dinner from that infamous scene. Uh, I love it. I love it. Thank you so much. Natalie uh, was there when 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 Spielzy bought it. <laughs> A little bit of gas, excuse me. All the but the butt butter makes you very gassy. That's what people don't realize about it. Equitable pros, thank you for that pipe there. Um, bet, 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 bet. Hair traff from this point out <laughs> that they spelled welcome wrong. Yeah. Is it my size though? Feelsy, it's not my size. Bring it back! <laughs> nah, it's my size. Um, you might remember this art from stream not too long ago. Made by uh, Karu, who is a friend of, uh, of, of Volps, who doesn't typically... Uh, spe I, I, I'm not sure. Karu may not even have a Twitch handle, uh, but Karu lurks. Uh, I, I love this. Karu, thank you so much. And I am I am going to see if, again... Yeah, I could get uh, I could get a, a, a frame for it. It's really cool. I'll put it up there one more time. Inspired by one of the drumming streams, obviously. Really fucking cool. Um, all right, I got I think one more thing here. If 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 I don't if you gave me something and I don't have it, that means it's probably sitting like in my car somewhere or or it's. It's in, it's in a pile or, or something somewhere. I, I I feel like I got through the majority of the gifts except this one. This was really cool and really sweet, and it made me a little uh, it made me a little emotional. But this gorgeous handmade Venetian mask doll was made by uh, JoJo Eats Flan. And it, it's it's definitely the the cutest thing that I received at the at the con. You can hear it's got the jinglies. Commands to jingling, and it's adorable and beautiful and cute. And I don't I don't think um, I don't think have I ever Protea at one point. Made me a, an, an Isaac like crochet doll, which was really cool. But I, I so this is the first I think my avatar uh, thing 
that, that was that was made. Oh, they also a scarf. Prody also made made a scarf. Um, but a doll? No, I don't think I ever got like a, yeah a Venetian mask doll. So it's very cat beautiful and cat, and I love it. And Jojo, thank you so much. It's really 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 sweet gift. Um, obviously a lot of work went into it. Totes adorbs. Um, I also received, and this was, this was hard to, to, to deal with. Um, right? It was hard, it was hard to, uh, uh, hold on a minute. Swiggy. Welcome back to the family, Swigs. Uh, Procuriosid Biped. You sent me but Bipes. Thank you for the Bipes. Um. When Bubba Fair gave me his, uh, <laughs> he had fucking cardboard boxes of shit. It included this. It says, to, to Michael, from everybody I could find who appreciates what you do. So you know this is getting, you know, it's getting, it's getting sappy, right? Of course, it's sealed with an Apple Dave sticker. It's a card. And I will read you this card. Hey, Mike. It's a bit hard to tell when you're joking because you're way too good at deadpan. Yeah, I got into that at the panel. I probably got to work on that. It's <laughs> confusing a lot, a lot of people, right? Uh, per curiosa, I'm, I'm sorry. I sent you 2,500 bipes and a thing. What, like in in person? Yeah, I don't know what you're. I don't know what you're. What you're. What you're talking. I feel like like now you sent it to me in the chat. On, uh, let me let me uh, later. Let me let me let me finish this. Sorry if I don't know what you're talking about, but we'll do we'll 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 deal with it. Um, it says you're way too good at deadpan. We wanted you to know that even though you're not the best gamer out there you're still pretty darn good no matter what some chuckle fucks might say to get under your skin you could have just just been like you're a great gamer next sentence could you say <laughs> we all care about you and are happy to see you doing what you love keep being a damn good drummer uh, and, and, and like everybody who was at the, 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 almost, it looks like almost everybody, uh, who was at the con signed to this. I see deaf mute. I see <laughs> Nathan who signed it. IDK who you are. <laughs> Thanks, Nathan. Diamond Dell, uh, ghost host, uh, Julie, somebody named Julie. Uh, there's a, it looks like a, a tiny little penis and the letter K. Uh, bitch pit. BK. George with, with, with a, with a very, a very cute little, little chode. A lot of dicks on here. A lot of dicks. Very dick heavy. <laughs> very dick heavy card. Uh, lots of love. Uh, bun time. With the little, little rabbit head. Uh, Ryan. Somebody named 520. Uh, Sal Miyaki, Little Bun, I Am Mullet, I have to, uh, Mullet Muffins maybe, uh, Micro, Ding, oh, whoa, that's how, this is how Dingo signed it, Ding, capital O, do, lowercase W, capital O, alright, stay, cl stay classy, Dingo, uh, Procuriosa, Angry Scapula, uh, Jojo, Buff Pretty Riku, uh, Mike L. The Epic. Ivan WB. Jo Joey uh, D. Is it Hungry Spy, perhaps? Yattermang. It's the police. Sfilzy. Somebody named Tim. Casquid. Uh, Matic. Automatic Manic. Uh, who I met and was was delightful. Uh, Mackerel, Lord Gubby, Nick Delcat, 
Gubby, you just, Gubby, Gubby drew like a, like a very, very long dick. Like that, you took up too much real estate with this, with this dick, Gubby. You took way too much fucking real estate, man. Uh, Ham Jam. Uh, st Sam Starkocker. Lounge Around. North Chaser. Too Cool for School. Kimmy. Dep Something I can't read, but thank you for signing this. Robo Livable. Somebody named Rivers. Um, Kale Matsuba. Uh, Josh and Fapples. Bubba Fair. Ballistic Buddha, who I had a I had a I had a great time uh, chatting with this this uh, this weekend. Um, Prince Protea. And also, it's hard to read a lot. They are, they are, they are John Hancock's. Hancock's. Red, red, red mist, red, red mist. I got red mist. I got Christina Ch Chadler. I got Max Wedgie. And Tina Stromboli. And I don't think uh, somebody named The Peach. Yes. Uh, let's get this. Let, let's 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 get this out of the way. Um, CWC. Yeah, it's uh, it's uh, it's yeah, it's Chris Chris Chan. Was in my panel and then and then uh, wanted something. Uh, wanted I, I signed I signed I signed something a a afterwards. Um, they ended up having to be removed from the from the premises uh, for um, a number of things. Uh, it's this is the type of thing where I got I feel like I don't really want to touch this. I don't know what's going on. It's none of my business. It's none of my business. Um, I'm out. I'm out. I'm fucking. I'm. I'm out. I'm out. Yeah. I feel like she is probably not a, a fan of, of of mine, but 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 probably just sat in every panel. That's that, that's what what happens, you know. That's 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 all. That's all that is. But kind of cool, right? Did, did that that the that, that internet celebrity? That means I'm famous, right? Okay. Um, what I wanted to say was before that fucking this hijacks the entire point of me reading this. Um, Now I go live night after night, and I, I I see a chat room filled with people, and you know I I see I see names, you know I see I see names and and, and stuff, and and that that's you know that's cool, and I could see a viewer count, um you know I mean I, but what the point that I'm trying to make is before this gets too sappy and long winded and my bread the bet. Because I, I have a very hard time expressing myself sometimes, especially when it comes to things like this. And could, you, could I get a more, like, like physical, tangible representation of, of how much, you know... I'm going to put it this way, like, how much we mean to each other? I don't think I can. And another thing, just... That, another thing that, fuck, that really got me was just standing in front of that panel and seeing it just the... A, f a full, almost, yeah, almost full room um, of people that, that came there to see me. Like, physically in, in, in front of me, people. Not a chat room filled with, with, with names that sometimes, you know, change. And it was a, it was a, it was a fuck. It was a very tangible um, indication of, of what, of what's going on here. Uh, it felt good. Um... I, I, it, it's like, 
was there like an ego element to it? Of course, because you know it was like I, I I had all these people that that came to see me. Like it's a, there's a vanity kind of an element to it. But I mean, this has been going on for for for, for three years. Let's not forget that this has been three years of, of, of my life. And the place that I'm in now compared to where I was before I started doing this, we've been over that lots of times. We've been over that probably way more than like it was it was okay to, 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 to go over it. Um, fuck, I can't even verbalize this. I love you all very much. I'm just gonna say, I'm gonna say that. And the idea that I have all of this, it was just the three days worth of, of confirmation that um, that I mean as much to you guys as you guys mean to me. Um, and that was very over overwhelming. I think that's the way to say that, what I'm, what I'm trying to say. So thank you guys for, um, first of all, for making the panel a success, uh, for making the entire weekend a, a, a success. And you know what? For making my, my fucking life a, a success. And all this making everything that I do um, a fucking a fucking success. Um, like I might, you know what? I, I, might, I might not be like the biggest, you know, I might be fucking PewDiePie or whatever. And and I, I, I may never be, but I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't care because I'm, I'm rich in love or something, is it? <laughs> Not that I'd want to be PewDiePie, right? Uh, you get what I meant by that though, right? Um, for a minute there, I was getting wrapped up in the fact that I wanted, I wanted, I wanted, um, you, it, YouTube in particular, um, to to kind of go somewhere and become something that would be, that would be bigger, um, and, and be something that you know I could, uh, I could like li live off of basically. I wanted YouTube to be bigger, and I put a lot of time and a lot of energy into it, and I was going really, 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 really hard with it, and I got a little bit burnt out, and I started getting bummed out that. It wasn't, it just, it didn't feel like it was, it was going anywhere. A lot of that had to do with the YouTube, uh, adpocalypse bullshit and everything. Um, and I started, I, I started feeling like, like shitty about it, but this weekend and honestly, like the lead up, uh, to, to this weekend, it was like you, you fucking, I, it was like, this is what you, you, you do have, you fucking idiot. Like, why do you care about that? Look at what you do have, and what I do have is this community. The individuals in 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 this in this channel right now, the individuals on the Discord, the individuals who came out to too many games. So, does 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 that? I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna be like the guy, the the oh fuck, the gears of war, <laughs> the gears of war, the gears of war dev who cried. <laughs> I'm not doing that. Don't worry. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not there. I'm not. I'm not there. I'm not. It's fine. Um. <laughs> someone on Twitter. Uh, I think. I think it was. Uh, I think it was Oni. Oni G. <laughs> retweeted the video and said watch this man cry <laughs> you feel your <laughs> and feel <laughs> your tits <laughs> filled with estrogen which that's not how biology works but um nah if I cry then then you know they're gonna call me a soy boy beta cuck on 4chan whatever they're gonna do that anyway but whatever I'm not you know I don't have the, I don't have the moisture right now so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna I don't have the moisture. I don't have the. <laughs> I'm not hydrated enough. I can't spare the. Uh, I can't spare the H2O. Um, I also got the chance to spend a lot of. Um, a lot of time with with people who've been in this community uh, for a while in a more intimate um, setting, and by that I mean we fucked. We fucked. We. <laughs> That's a joke. There was no fucking. Um, 
but yeah, where there was a little bit of an opportunity to like hang out in hotel rooms and like play video games and bullshit. And like I said, with the art and stuff like that. And that was a really cool thing too, because a lot of these people have been there for me through through some, you know, some 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 dark shit. Um and um there was a kind of um uh, an ability to re reciprocate some of that stuff in 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 a way that I don't think I I would have had otherwise. I don't know. This is this isn't making sense anymore. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to shut the fuck up, but you know. Yeah, I'm going to just shut the fuck up. This was an amazing weekend. Uh you guys are all amazing. You made it amazing uh for me. So, thank you. Uh Vinehart wants to know about the B dubs thing with the old lady. Yeah. Yeah, I got yeah, we'll yeah, we'll do that. <laughs> so it on one such occasion, uh it was the first night that I was there. I got there on Thursday, and me and uh me me and me and some 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 folks met up. I went to have dinner at B dubs. I'm using my photographic memory to tell you who was there. Cute Dingo, Star Heaven, Jurge, Microgravity, Buntime, me, Lich Pit. All right. And we're sitting, we're, we're, we're sitting there and we're getting, you know, we're figuring out what we're going to order. And um, some people at the table ordered, ordered, uh, I, I believe it's called a Blue Hawaiian. It's some kind of really, you know, fruity, tropical drink. Uh, it's blue. And it's like a, it goes through a blender, so it's like that slushy consistency. It's not on, you know, it wasn't on the rocks or whatever. And it had a little, you know, a little umbrella in it, and there's a cherry in it, and there's a, there's an orange uh, slice in it. And I took a sip of somebody's, and I'm like, you know what? I want that. I want that. I don't care what anybody thinks, you know, if this, because because it's not probably not a very like masculine drink, but you know what? It was fucking delicious. Fuck it. I'm getting it. I want one. It's delicious. I'm 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 drinking it, right? So I order it and it comes and there's, there's a cherry in there. And uh I I was reminded of the the, the, the JoJo uh fucking anime and I and I never watched it, but I did see the scene where what happens the the dude ties a, a cherry stem into a knot with his tongue. And I never tried to do that before, so I said, fuck it, you know what I mean? I feel like I might be able to do that. And I did it. It took me like eight minutes. It took me fucking eight full minutes of sitting at the table like... For like eight fucking minutes while people are trying to eat food, right? <laughs> And eventually, I do it. And, you know, I showed everybody. I'm like, look. And they're like, oh, that's impressive. And I, you know, I, I wanted, I wanted, I wanted everybody to understand the the implications of, of that. And of course, the implications that is that like I'm really good at oral sex, right? So I said that just to make sure. I said just so everybody knows, like this means that I'm really fucking good uh, at oral sex. Um, and I guess, uh, I guess, I guess that, I guess I said it too loud because then this happened. Working on it. That's wrong. We will get to that later. Hold on. So this picture was, was taken. All right. Um, I just want to really dig really quickly dig in dig into this here uh it says so this was a this was a <laughs> the dm from george to uh i believe lich says this lady has been looking at our table like this for like 10 minutes let's get in there let's fucking really dig into this here <laughs> man i wish this was easier to do Kind of taking the fucking juice out of it. Now that is, that's horror. That's horror. Computer enhanced. I mean, the, the idea that I could elicit... 
fucking come on, man. <laughs> that I could have listened. <laughs> that I could have listened. That that kind of emotion in another human being is just. I I feel bad about it. But it's also I don't know that I think there's a there's a a pride like a pr <laughs> a pride point here. <laughs> Uh, is it a new emote? Can somebody fucking... Can somebody capture that? I don't know. I don't know that there's, like, an artist in this world honestly talented enough to, to really... to capture, like, whatever emotion that is. Logan Webman. Welcome to the family, Logan. Thank you so much. I mean, like, I, I'm, I'm trying to figure out if it was that comment that did it. Because there's a possibility, because what happened later on was I ate the orange that uh, wedge that was in the drink. And then I had the rind left over. And I, um, you know, I announced to the table that the, I, I said, for my next trick, I'm going to tie this orange peel into a knot with my asshole and then i stood up and 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 you know acted out the idea of and mock put the, the fucking orange rind down my pants so it could have been that that did it it could have been it could have been that little scarlet um i was not drunk at all i was not drunk it was one like very barely alcoholic drink it was just delicious i don't think that um you know, I, I I feel bad. I do. If you're here, uh, B B B, -dub, B Dubs, uh, woman, if this is you and you're watching this now, maybe you found one of my business cards in the fucking parking lot of the convention center and you decided to check out the Twitch channel. Let me apologize for whatever that is. I mean, this is a, this is a common thing, and I was trying to. We were talking about this a little bit uh, before, you know, right, when we sat down before we ordered, about how I don't realize how loud I am in a lot of situations. Um, I don't realize how loud I am in, in public. And this has been a recurring fucking issue uh, with family members and, and friends where like they just don't like really like they're embarrassed to go out to eat with me because I because of shit like this. Like this has been a, a recurring problem my entire life. And now you guys, you guys got a taste. The people who were at this dinner got a, got a taste of it. So there it is. Uh, let me let me apologize formally to this woman because this is rough. Um, Ploptypus says, what do you mean a common thing? How often do you talk about tying knots with your anus? It's me. It's my brain. Like, not specifically that, but and maybe you're new to the channel. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, there's a lot. Yeah, there's a lot going on. Ploptypus, you are not new to the channel. I just realized. Flesky, have a great night at work. It was awesome to meet you at the con. I hope you had a... Uh, safe and not annoying trip home um i also wanted to point the, uh to, to show you guys these i'd meant to show you before when i when i showed you guys the breaking bad bootleg but uh ivan ivan wb uh had a very interesting find at the convention you may remember last year we were we were taking a look at some of the shitty the shitty little pokemon uh really really little little pokemon figures that are so obviously bootleg um, there were more of them. I was perusing through them. A lot of them didn't look very interesting to me, but some people bought bags. Like, there were bags that had, like, if you bought a bag, probably, like, a couple bucks had, like, 10, 15 figurines in it, right? Very interesting one from... from Ivan. Uh, that at least I found it mildly amusing. Squidge, squidge. It's not squidge. Uh, but uh, when Ivan showed me this, he he said, "I want, I need, I need, I need you to see a uh, questionable arm positioning muck." Now, I don't. I'm not. I'm not going to say anything else. I'm just going to let you. <laughs> what's what's he uh, what's he doing there? Why why is he um? Why is he... Is it Grimer or is it... Is it Muck? It's Muck. 
Is it the wrong arm, Black Bear? I mean, well, 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 shit. He only has one. He only has one. It's Grimes. <laughs> yeah, whimsical lifestyle. Um, it looks like he's got his hand one someone blowing. <laughs> it does. She's still reacting as well. She's she should. Um, no, it, it looks to me like like a uh, like a Nazi salute. I I, I thought I Ivan as well. Um, if anybody else has some fun uh, stupid bootlegs that they got, like these Pokemon, because there there were a lot of these floating around. If you got a fun one, uh, like you know like Muck Muck Kyle here, uh, send send them over so we could look, take a look at them on stream. I want this to keep going. I want this to keep evolving. Evolving, no pun intended, over time. Yeah, see if you got any really stupid ones. Uh, anybody who bought... I should have bought some, but I, I, I didn't. Um, I bought some other stuff. Like, I bought... If anybody's familiar with... Where the fuck did it go? Where the fuck is the... Uh, Pat Country, the... Uh, the, the Nest Punk. Bought his, uh, bought his book, finally. I'd been meaning to pick this thing up for a long time. Bap, bap, bap. Really cool. Goes through the entire history of the Nintendo uh, entertainment system. Really good um poop book. Like, put this, you know, in the uh, in the banyo. Pop in, drop a deuce, read up on a, on a classic game. Really fucking awesome. Also, I got, got his John Hancock. We have very similar hair, I, I noticed. Um, you got it too, Toxic? Yeah, it's very, it's very comprehensive. Um, is there anything left to show you guys? I don't know. I think we went over literally anything. Uh, literally everything. Oh, yeah. Dragisha. Lich Pit a a actually has that. She brought it home uh, by accident, but she also stole all of my fucking candy. There's a booth at Too Many Games that has all that imported uh, candy from Japan. Like, <coughs> excuse me, the mochi balls and things like that and Pocky and stuff. And uh, I was just, I, I spent like, I think like 15 bucks at that, at that booth, just loading up on like basically shit that I had last year that I thought was awesome that I wanted to have this year. And Lich Pit stole it. So. Fuck me, I guess. Yeah, fuck you, Jabroni Mike. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. Yeah. Um, show them the pins. Uh, I don't know where those are, but uh, George made some really cool. Wait, I lied. They're right here. Hey. Really cool pins that we were giving out when, when people at the panel got the correct answer to the trivia uh, question. We gave him a pin. That's part of the, the, the lack of preparation. Like, we, we, we got, what happens if they win? Like, what do we give them? What, the... Very cool. It says Jabroni Mike, TMG, uh, 2018. Now, I still have a nice, decent amount of them. Guess I'll give them out next year, right? Oh, wait. They say TMG 2018 on them. So, uh, I fucked up. Big surprise there, right? Uh, I don't know what, uh, you know what, man? Like, I'll fucking just... Next year. If you're at the con and you were at this one, then you get to have one. That's how we'll do it. You get a, you, you got a whole year without actually having it in your possession, but you will eventually eventually get one. Yeah. Um. I feel like I had some other shit like I wanted to talk about, but obviously I can't remember any of it. So what time is it? It's almost seven o'clock. So this is like, did we really just sit here and like just bullshit for two hours with no video game or anything or anything like that? That's wild. Um, art. There was a lot of cool art 
on, on Twitter that I saw um, while I was at the convention. Kind of want to take a look at some of it because I don't know if we're going to get another opportunity to um, to do so. I mean, after a stream, maybe, but... Here's hoping they use the hashtag because if they didn't... Nope. They did. Let me see what we got here. Uh, but, 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 but. Did we look? We looked at that one. Yeah, yeah. Hold on. Spaghetti Puncher. Made this from the other night when Mike said he had caveman DNA. <laughs> Jabroni, smash! Jabroni, smash! <laughs> Yeah, the Crow Magnon uh, skull structure, which a lot of you actually got to see in person. Can you back me up on this? Because I feel like people don't believe me. Oh, yeah, uh, the emails, uh, Procurios. I will check out the emails, yeah. Uh, right after this, because I'm already, this has already happened. This is from Zane Tortellini. Says, I'm not at TMG, but Jabroni Mike looked like he's about to, to pitch his pussy, bussy slaying business to a crowd of funders. There I am in, this is actually what I'm wearing right now. And again, it still has the con juices soaked into the, uh, into the fabric. I'm never going to wash it. You know how many hugs I received in this, in this blazer? I'm never going to wash this blazer. I'm never, never going to, which again, apparently if I do try to wash it, it falls apart. But, but again, I digress. Thank you for this awesome art, uh, Zane Tortellini. As part of my adult human man cosplay. And also something from Primal Screen Guy. It says... Welcome back, Mike. Sometimes I could be considered as the quickest artist of the year, so I drew this. It is lovely, uh, Primal Screen Guy. Thank you. So and my fancy new hat that I love. Thank you so much. Uh, Equitable Pros has something that was inspired or... Uh, taken from a photo that was that I remember taking with George equitable pros I spent a frankly ridiculous amount of time on this aesthetic yeah it was a, a a very blurry photograph who's that in the in the back there that's weird I don't remember that person being there but yeah uh, I made a stupid face which I usually never do for pictures, but I think I would actually at this point. Yeah, I may have had a few drinks at this point. Now, I never got drunk. All right. I never got drunk at this convention, but I did have I did put away a few cold ones with the boys. You better believe it. Is that your stand? <laughs> is this George's stand? Yeah, it is lovely. I'm going to check out the emails. Hang out. I did tell you guys to set to send me some emails. Uh, but, 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 so, yes, this is an absolutely adorable pick of me and, and Bun Time. She's getting a jabroni back ride. This is actually how Bun Time uh, made her way around the convention, like, the entire weekend. Uh, she was just bumming pig piggyback rides for, from people everywhere. Um, by the end of the, of the weekend, we all had, like, some pretty fucking severe lower back pain. Uh, I actually had to be brought home uh, on a stretcher. Uh, me personally, uh, Bun Time, thank you for the, uh, the 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 memories and the excruciating back pain. Really appreciate it. I jest, of course. Uh, I had a really good time hanging out with Bun Time. Also, Bun Time did a Ness cosplay, which I used the hat for during my panel when I wanted to do the. <laughs> hey, Gabriel. <laughs> Hey kids, heard you guys like video games. <laughs> I had like my Steve Buscemi like trying to relate to the kids moment at the panel. And the backwards baseball cap was a very important piece to that puzzle. Thank you for letting me borrow it one time. Enjoy the lice. Okay, uh, moving on. Some other picks. This is me and uh, Diamond Dell. I'm going to just, yeah, I want to I wanna save all these. In this picture... Um, you can see, if you look really hard, the sweat pit stains on the shirt, which is very upsetting to me. So, 
Don't look at it anymore. But other than that, nice picture. Uh, this is me and... Yes, this is... Oh, by the way, do you, do you guys... I don't know if you guys want me to show these. I just kind of said... I said email them to me. I don't know how many actually... I don't know if you guys want me to put these up there. If you want me to put them up there, say so. Because I don't know if... I said I wanted them. I didn't say I was going to show them on stream, so... Uh, let's not do that. Wedgie says the tape is a bootleg JVC blank tape. No mixtape to be had. Oh, it's a blank tape. Okay. Sal Miyake, you want me to show that photo? Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, it's cool because I want to compile these. Uh, compile all these anyway. Put them in. A, put them in a folder. Slap them on the external. But I can't find it. There's a lot of DMs in here. Uh, bop, 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 bop. Where is it at? Oh, I got it. Really fucked cool pick. Sal Miyake in a Tots adorbs dress. Very cute. Uh, bop, bop, bop. Really good time. Thank you for that chocolate. Uh, Samiyaki, that was delicious. Uh, what do you got here, Ivan? Some picks? Got some hot picks? Oh, who's this? Oh, I remember this guy. Hold on. Please d download, download it. Yeah, just download, download, down, uh, download. The, 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 thank you for download. Uh, one of the other bootleg pogies that we found. Ah, uh, you motherfucker. Hold on. Let me try to get it right side up for you. Hold on one second. One second. You piece of shit. Why aren't you... OBS is doing a very stupid thing right now. Uh... There we go. I guess it's a Mudkip. Like, I don't even know what the fuck Pokemon it is. But you can see the, the, the left arm is... Looks like it was involved involved in some kind of industrial machine accident. It's completely... It's completely flattened. And it is not... <laughs> it's not the shape or size or anything of, of the other one. I sort of feel like that's not... What the Pokemon is supposed to look like. Part of the problem with the boot, and you, you saw this during the bootleg stream, is like, for all, most of the gens, I don't know what the original Pokemon is supposed to look like, so I have no idea what the fuck's going on. He's seen some shit, Anagelical. Yeah, he's seen he's seen some shit. Um, I'm checking my my email again. Hold on. Uh, bu -bu 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 Sam Ricker. Says, here's, oh shit, 12 minutes of your uh, TMG panel. That's awesome. Um, what, I, what I wanted was, I wanted the whole thing. Uh, to, to, I, I would put it on YouTube and everything so people could watch it and shit. But uh, I guess we're going to have to settle for like 12 minute clips. I will download them. Maybe find, a, maybe find a cool way to edit them together so it's not all like stupid and bad. Uh, like everything else I try to do. <laughs> um, yeah. You know what? Two hours of talking. You can hear my voice is still trying to recover. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to call it there. I don't think I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to stream uh, anything else tonight. Uh, but tomorrow night, uh, we're going to... I'm definitely streaming. I'm going to find some... Um, I'm going to try to figure out what games I want to start. I want to start some new games. I think one of them... Yeah, is going to be Okami, which I've been uh, looking to... Getting around to for a while. There's other games I want to start. I don't know if that's going to be tomorrow night, but it is going to be... It's on the near horizon. Let me see what I got. Obviously, after this this weekend, I have a whole lot more I could dig into. So, the landscape has changed here. I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I do know that right now, I'm going to go rest this thrusty. Uh, maybe drink some tea. Uh, guys... Thank you for hanging out here and listen to me just gush over my awesome, amazing fans who I love. 
fucking more than life itself at this point. Guys, I'll say it again. Thank you for making this weekend a success for me. Uh, and thank you for making this fucking, for everything I, I've, I've done in the past three years a success. Um, I don't know, like, there's there's so much when I'm when I'm trying to be to be grateful to you guys. It's it's just fucking I'm I'm constantly stumbling over my words. I I don't know how to vocalize a lot of this, and I think at one point I'm gonna have to just make a video about this. But as for right now, I'm gonna shut the fuck up. Um, interestingly enough, yeah, there were some new names in here tonight in in the uh, in in the channel. Um, there's, there, thank you, Omseal. You you will find links to my social media and YouTube's in the chat if you by some some somehow don't know who the fuck I am. Find out with the links. Um, and yeah, I love you all. Full homo hair trap from full fucking full on balls to the wall, gay mo sexual. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not Vinny Scrap to Spare, no. Okay, on that note. Time to go. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna need a few days before I could do, uh, before I could do the Mario again. All right, seriously, I'm out. Guys, lots of love. It was awesome getting to meet so, so many of you. And tomorrow night, uh, I think we are gonna start something new. I don't know what yet, but whatever. Find out. Stay tuned to find out. Where? <laughs>